Okay, hey everyone. I'm down to 16 days until my competition, and tonight was an early night, relatively early, but the best part of the day in terms of my fitness goals was uh, getting a chance to try on my figure competition suit. Gia finished working on it today, and um, and I got to, to try it on and everything, and that's when I think everything became a little bit more real than it already was. Um, but just being able to get into the suit, seeing how it looks, seeing how my body has changed since even the last time that I tried it on, that was, that was really cool. So, um, so that was, that was a really good part of the day. And just talking about my fitness goals with my parents, two parents tonight at, uh, the pasta party that we have for the cross country team, that was really cool as well. One of my boys, when I walked in, who's following me on Instagram, said, uh, Coach, you are really strong, and I would have liked your picture, but I kind of wanted to just cry myself to sleep instead because of how strong you are. So I thought that was pretty cool because they're starting to see the, the big changes that are going on with me as well. Um, the gym workout was really good. Uh, bear crawls, those are pretty challenging. At first I thought, oh, this is easy. I could do this all day long. You know, everything was for a minute straight, so it was bear crawls followed by... Um, heavy bag punching, so side to side, making sure that the core was engaged while I was hitting that. And then followed by jump squats, which we all know by now I don't like jump squats. But for a minute straight, I think my legs are actually getting stronger, so I could actually do them for a full minute. So that was pretty cool. Um, so the jump squats followed by calf raises, followed by V-ups. I'm still not a fan of V-ups. I know that they work, but they are really hard, and I have challenge or I have difficulties trying to make it through that whole minute doing them. But um, this was the first time within the workouts where I've been able to go through all of the exercises, have exactly one minute of rest, and then go right back into it again. So I think my fitness levels are going back up again in that regard. Um, but one of the things that I noticed today in terms of my diet part of it, and um, I finally realized today that I am on a diet. Normally I'm on a healthy lifestyle, that's the, that's the way that I eat, the six meals a day, um, that's something that's inherent to me, but what I'm on right now is a, a true restriction of the foods that I am allowed to eat and the foods that I'm not allowed to eat. But what I realized was ketosis is real. What that is, is my body is, I'm only eating enough to, to get to the next meal. My body is, as a result, burning the food very quickly and using the fat stores as energy instead of using other sources as energy. So whenever I finish a meal, as soon as I finish, and I felt that for the first time this evening, as soon as I finished, my energy levels spiked. And it was something very noticeable, not only for me, but for the other people that I was talking to. The mom that I was talking to noticed it even. Um, so I thought that that was pretty strange. I had never had that complete effect before, um, the tiredness and an immediate, immediate spike in energy, but I was told that it was coming. So it actually happened tonight. So I know that my body is actually doing what it's supposed to. My body fat percentage right now is down to about 9.3. So I know that it's going to keep dropping within these next two weeks. And I'm just anxious to see where it actually gets to. So overall, um, today was a good day. I didn't bite anybody's head off or anything like that because of hunger or tiredness. Last night I actually slept like a log, so I know that my body is appreciating the recovery time that it's getting. Um, but yeah, that's day 16 or 16 days out, and I'll be ready for tomorrow. I need to go do some meal prep right now. It is 10.30. Hopefully I'll be in bed by 11. Still have to take a shower and all that stuff, but I think I can make that happen. So... Have a good one.